What is going on guys? My name is Cliff and today I am going to be talking about the best gun in Advanced Warfare right now. But before we get started with that, of course, we gotta talk about the gameplay in the background. So what you are watching is a double DNA bomb on the map, Solar, and it is solo and I think the most impressive thing about this gameplay is that he's doing it in the game mode uplink. Now you don't really see a lot of double DNA bombs or DNA bombs at all in uplink. I think so I think that's pretty impressive that uh, our guy Swifty was able to get that. So if you do enjoy the gameplay, be sure to go check him out. His link will be in the description below along with mine. So now that we got that settled, now we can get into the topic of today's video. So yesterday I got home from vacation after being a week out of the country on a cruise ship with no internet. And that was so painful. I got home and I was like, I need to play Advanced Warfare. So for about 10 hours straight, I just grinded it out. And when I say grinded it out, I mean I played terribly because I am very bad at video games. But I was trying out all these new things and I tried out the ASM-1 and I found it was so much fun. And then I looked up some tips and tricks videos on how to make it even better. And what I ended up doing is I ended up dropping like some insane 50 kill gameplays in momentum. And you might think, 50 kills, that's it? Well, guess what? I usually get like 20 kills in momentum. And maybe 25 if I'm lucky, because like I said before, I am just very bad at Call of Duty. So I think that it's just so good that the ASM1 with extended mags, that's the key, is that the extended mags attachment, it just makes the gun so good because it gives you 67 bullets. 67. Seven. Think about how many times you can kill somebody without reloading, and that is so vital to getting good gameplays because with, if you have to reload, then it's just so hard to kill people because if you're reloading, you're not firing your gun, which means they could be firing at you and killing you. So just if you want to try this out, I think this is the best gun in Advanced Warfare right now. I think it do, does actually need a uh, nerf because it is so strong. It's getting you in the range where you're having the same amount of bullets per magazine as an LMG, but with the accuracy and damage of a SMG. So I think that is why it is just so incredible, and I'm actually doing well for once a little bit in Call of Duty. So, I mean, if I can do that good with this gun, I think you could too. So, actually, this is really my opinion, though. So, I understand that some of you guys might be like, whoa, 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 let's take a step back, let's pump the brakes, let's land the plane, and take a step back. Now, that's, because of that, I want you guys to let me know what you believe the, the best gun in Call of Duty is right now um, for Advanced Warfare, because I would love to try it out personally, and I'm sure other people could use some help as well as me, because like I said before, since I'm not good, I could always use the, the most and help and use the best and most OP gun because that's like really the only way I can do do well in Call of Duty. I mean, I've never gotten a, a DNA bomb yet in Advanced Warfare, and you might be like, oh, it's not, it hasn't been out that long. Well, I've never gotten a Moab, a KM Strike, a Tactical Nuke, any of that stuff because it's just so hard for me. I mean, I'm not very good. And then all of a sudden, I see people like this dropping double DNA bombs, and I'm like, how do they do it? And I think this personally, um, Swifty was only able to do it, uh, at least in this case, because he had so many bullets in his magazine that it made it so much easier for him to kill so many people and get a double DNA bomb. Now, I'm not saying you're going to go out there and drop like triple DNA bombs and quad vicious medals by using the ASM-1 with extended mags, but it, I believe it will increase your chances insanely. So if you guys do want to try that out, that would be awesome. And maybe it'll even let me know if it did help. And if it didn't, then let me know that too. Because I understand this is probably not the best thing for everybody. But if you do find something better, like I said before, comment down below what your favorite gun and favorite attachments are and whatnot. Because I want to use them. And maybe other people do too. So with the gameplay winding down now, I just think that it's... with. It's necessary to tell you guys to go check out Swifty again. He is such an amazing player. I mean, like, I don't understand how people can be so good at video games. It really blows my mind. So I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary and the gameplay. And I want to, to all go out there and get some insane gameplays. I mean, that's all I can say. And I hope you guys all have a great day, a great week, a great month, a great year, and a great lifetime. And until next time, I will see you all later.